Hello guys, welcome to today's show. My name is Nachos and you're on GFL TV, the home of football. So if today is the first time we to see our program, for you we will bring you the latest Arsenal news updates as they drop all over the world. So for now, we'll start with today's news. Our Peter Schmeichel will be one of the Manchester United legends. Don't come as I can't give him prediction for how the season will turn out. See how he don't see people will buy, who buy strongly, who don't buy well. So Baba Kali talks in the way they see everything say Arsenal can finish in the top four. And it is for the first time when for in life when they look at Arsenal and they got the thing say, ah um, this Arsenal, they don't strong now. Like this Arsenal can finish in the top four. And what did they give and the morale? What did they give him the authority to speak on this matters? He don't see the way we Arsenal strengthen. Arsenal buy serial winners. So he buy somebody in the mode of Zinchenko from Man City. That person will be say, you know, so I remember when Mourinho talks, <laughs> there are three teams that can win the league. As of then, say Liverpool can win the league, Man City can win the league. Then Man City second eleven can win the league. You see that Man City second eleven, the good die, the good all of them. So Baba the talks is Zinchenko will join Arsenal. Then a Gabriel Jesus, that Gabriel Jesus, now one man riot is the game changer. That one, before you're going to talk about Fabio Vieira, we never even play at all. Though. That one, I like assistant to the guard. That one, never even play at all. Though. Going to get Emi Smith who scored 11 goals last season. That one, never even feature. You are having a Tomiyasu. Imagine, say, this lineup will take place Sevilla and I'll be our first 11. Then for the bench, you're going to see somebody like Kerry Antieni for bench. This is Tomiyasu for bench. This is Rob Holding for bench. No, no, that kind of level. Then at the same time, you can't see like Fabio Vieira for bench. That one for you, you know why I me? Mean? Emi Smith for bench. Before you can't you talk about our normal, normal, small, small, ah, no, 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 no. The bench, you don't know, get small, small depth the way we like him. So, but back on the praise, the Arsenal hierarchy. And this man, no, be seen an Arsenal legend, or no, be seen an Arsenal fan, favorite fan, or anything, no. Now, Manchester United, but now people will be saying they'll be pundits when they see things objectively. They don't speak with the bias, you get? So, whatever about the comments and the tell and talk, say, Arsenal, I'm seeing them ending up in top for life for the first time in my life. I will come outside and say, ah, Arsenal top four. Then Manchester United will come be in your club. You know they write them well, say they will do well because they didn't buy players. I mean, they don't buy. They don't buy Malaysia. They buy Eriksen. Who else they buy? It makes sense. Nobody. They are begging Ronaldo to stay. Ronaldo doesn't want to stay because at his age, he doesn't want to be rebuilding. So I never know how when I react to this news, you Peter Schmeichel, the talk say when they see Arsenal finishing in the top four for this new coming season. What do you not think? Then away from that, so Rams done the closing on the deal to sign Volari Balogu on loan. And they say Balogu don't agree terms and condition with them. He can't remember they signed everything to paper so that the guy could go for France, go develop. That's what we are talking about. Go out, develop. Next season, come back and tell us, just show us what you've learned to get. So next season, we should be expecting people like Volari Balogu. Uh, then you know, Tavares they should be coming back and showing us what they have to offer. I guess now we've done the transition from young star, young star, like young, inexperienced people, you get small leader. They move to a, a, a like age bracket of that kind 25, 24. People will say you can't call them small league game because they don't they mature into the game. Here in Gabriel Magal is what they call small league game, forgetting age. The guy don't mature when it comes to football. Okay, Gabriel is just really, I think 25 or there about here. Now you want to call small league again. You don't over mature for football. That's how they score goals for fun. Just give our boy the boss next for you. I'm okay, and look at the mass yourself. Don't come as I call it. Let us know say Sam Doria. The reason say they would like to carry Lucas Torreira on loan or whatever, on buying, anyhow, we ask now one drum. So they need the guy bad, bad, bad. So Arsenal will prepare to sell out to them. And in case you don't know, or maybe you don't forget, now from Sam Dury and I asked now buy this to Castorella in 2018. Now, now the guy will be that dream move according to them. But irrespective of him being that dream move, they are still going for another player from Roma. But then the reason say that player will go for Roma now because they didn't look say Torreira fit day beyond their reach. Because their dream move would have been to bring back their former player because when it comes to Italian Serie Torreira is the master of the game, he understands it fully. But when it comes to EPL, I don't know why he's struggling. So that's why Fiorentina said, kind of, for a player to be Fiorentina player of the season, you don't know what he means. And Fiorentina done themselves, I'm going to no sign him now. 
So I don't know. Roma self said they want sign him. Many people don't really interested in him. Say they would like to come carry him. But I never know what Arteta gets for a plan because Arteta knows that people are interested in this guy. And for outside the year, they don't even carry his squad number. Give another player. So I don't really know how all this is pan out. So as it seems, they get more clarity. I will let you know. Amadou um, Tavares don't officially move to Marcel on a one year long season loan. So our prayer now make him replicate the same thing way Saliba do for DM. Because Saliba go there, come become a beast, come come back now. Nah, it's just everybody don't be happy with Saliba. Even though me in the beginning, I'll be the guest on small small doubts for Saliba. But I think I'm joining the bandwagon now to say Saliba is a good player. But let's see. Because I just like some statistics they talk to any match you ask them play with. William Saliba, Gabriel Mogales, Ben White, and it's in general of fact, say it go hard for people to break that back, one score, our Rams, they will be another sneer man for post the game. So I just like as everything they go, say at least, we don't, for defense, we don't get problem for defense. We will really get problem for me, oh, my own personal opinion. We will get problem at the middle of the park. We need a replacement for party. Somebody capable of this, I'm not talking about El Nene. Bring in another player, I guess, somebody else, because we are playing multiple competition. So if Pate go out now, nah, so we'll put in El Nene go. But if Shaka go out, we'll come put in Lokonga. To say there's a deficit in that defensive midfield department, we need one player. Then in that striking department, we need one player. Because for the wings, we don't really get problem because even Fabio Vieira himself has been deployed as a right winger. He gets, he can play there. Then Martinez himself can play nine. Then Marquinhos can go to his wing. So we get, still get some kind of management, management. So we do for the wings. But you see that defensive midfield you need energy, you need energy. You know, Fabio Vieira won't come put as a defensive uh, player role. So we go put there. So that place, there's a deficit there. We need to fix that gap. Um, Eda Simuarez will be Manchester City goalkeeper. I'll come aside and congratulate Gabriel Jesus on his move to Arsenal. And for the fact, say he scored three goals against a Sevilla side. Because everybody know the caliber of people with it, how good Sevilla did. So, for the talk, say almost say him with Gabriel Jesus and Gabriel Jesus family, they're very, very close. I say he wish Gabriel Jesus family a lot of success. And when you check him, like, say Gabriel Jesus don't score. Seven goals in five preseason matches for you to know. Say this guy is a natural born goal scoring machine. That is why some people they talk say Man City will regret why they flush them out. Go we'll bring Julian Alvarez and Ellie Haaland because these two people are not as prolific as you think they are. Fine, they, they score goals for like Julian Alvarez for River Plate. The score goals are plenty there. Ellie Haaland did not want the score goals, but this is CPL. You can learn from the template of Lukaku. This is EPL. EPL is not a cattle. It's not. It's not anything. It's not where you can play. You get. It's not a playing ground for children. You have men, men do here. So you know easy. It's not so easy. Ronaldo for score twenty five goals now. You know easy like that. You get. So let's see how it goes here. I'm a right king self. Now come outside when they hear when people they talk say a man city go regret. They say Jesus. They say Sterling. They say Zinchenko. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can come and say they don't go regret anything. Stop saying that. That they will not regret anything. The Man City now they are transitioning from their style of play to something else. Guardiola and person say he don't like to play number nine. He gets. He doesn't like. He doesn't use the focal points. If they use different tactics, they different people just they interchange their role. First nine, first nine everywhere. Nobody will talk. So this is the number nine. But now for the first time, he wants to deploy a number nine. We will say now what time will they use? He's now using a Julian Alvarez. Or an early Haaland, so that the tactics way he won't come deploy now. So you know they see Arsenal as a threat. Say maybe I give now Jesus. Okay, now can you prepare me? No, that doesn't see all those ones. But waiting, Baba failed to understand. me say you giving us Gabriel Jesus. Obviously, you strengthen us. He has to understand that you strengthen us. You also give us a Zinchenko. You strengthen us. Remember, say you can club the complaints. Say what's Man City do? He no good. Do. See, they will strengthen Arsenal, they will give Arsenal serial winners, give Arsenal players. The players can come off, lift the atmosphere everywhere, when they go rose, everywhere, when they you get. And whether you like it or yes, Arsenal has upgraded and benefited from the benevolence and the generosity of Man City. You cannot take it away from Arsenal, you get. Because when we play against Man City, there are some chances. So nobody will create chance. No matter who you be, who will play against you, we go create chance. And when we create the chance, we usually know they get players who so they prolific enough to bury the ball in the back of the net. Now we have somebody who can do this. Even if you give him a half chance, he can create something out of nothing for himself and go and score. And you are saying, 
we are not a threat. Which means my start now. Pray more cash man, you say. <laughs> that that man, you are like people who leak like a photo soup. I'm even Jimmy Carter himself don't come outside from media settings. We no see Baba and pawn it now. And I want to maybe like the guy be saying the day objective where we. So Baba can come outside the talk say ask now is in a better position than they were one year ago. What do you mean by that? One year ago we were strong. We are having people like uh, Sambi Lokonga in the middle of the park. We are having people like only Edin Ketia in the front. Edin Ketia is good but it's not prolific. There's a difference. There's a difference. You are good but not prolific. The same thing with Lacazette. Lacazette was past his prime, past his everything, everything we want to think about. We are having somebody in the mode of Lacazette in the front. We will say we create 20 chances before he goes score one. So imagine that kind of thing. And now we now have a Fabio Vieira. We give 16 assists for Porto before he come EPL. We now have a McQueen who's we play for Sao Paulo. We have them win. Get one major competition with them, please. So I don't forget we have them win because the guy is very instrumental for the right wing. Then we have a Saliba. We win the Young Player of the Year award. Saliba is like a new signing to me. You get you can never play for us before. We are bringing in Saliba. We'll be the rock of Gibraltar. He's the same height with Virgin Van Dyke. Person will talk. If they feel say Gibraltar Mogales talk, they imagine person can talk past Gibraltar Mogales. That is why the partnership between Saliba and Mogales in the heart of our defense is going to be very, very formidable because two of them are tall. Gibber Mogales normally, if you jump with that, he will know that house. Saliba normally, if you jump with that, he will know that house. So we are having two rocks of Gibraltar. They can carry the third center back in Ben White, come put that for the right swing. I want to cross and not, now they want me. So when you, as an objective journalist without a bias, sit down, when they look at all these variables, the people we ask now sign, and yet still keeping their homegrown stars, keeping people like Bukayo Saka, Odegaard, you know, Ramsdale, uh, Amy Smith Rowe, Martinelli, all these people, nobody left. Right? The Shaka party, the core of the team is still there. Now added some kind of extra bites. Come on, what do you expect to happen when the season starts? We're seeing banger, banger, banger everywhere. 4 0, 5 0, 3 0, 2 0. Chances are plenty. So now, so it will be. Even Michael Lowe said, don't come and say, I can't talk to you. You say, oh, man, say this season, Asna. Bifun, say Asna. This season, they will see them entering top four. He's seen it. Say, Asna really, really strengthened. Like, they really did well. So this season is going to be different to get because in the city, that city change, uh, City and, and Liverpool, they did change playing style because, you know, say Liverpool now, normal, normal, they used to. Sala, Salamani, 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 that money don't come out. Nice, Saladias, Saladias, that with Nunes, that's a change in style. Now they want to be focusing on the focal points. Before, now for me, you did for that night. For me, you do it. The Gujota did for that night. That short man devil. You get it. Now they're bringing in down with Nunes. In case people they play 10 man behind the ball, then Alexander Arnold go feed the square play. Man City, on the other hand, self, they do the same thing because in case they don't say anybody they play with the small now they like to play 10 man behind the ball they cannot do the square play now and when you look at an Ellen Haaland he's 6 foot 5 inches tall the guy is a giant he top he top pass our Gabriel Mogales he top pass Saliba for you to know how tall he is so in the air a banga anything so that is why they are changing their playing style to suit how going to, it's going to go forward so why they talk say for them to do that is going to affect the way they play and other people don't strengthen like Arsenal, like Spurs, like che no, throw it Chelsea. Arsenal Spurs, don't we take advantage of everything? Well, that's what you're seeing. I'm a Jimmy Carragher said, don't come again, come to talk, say, see, I'm making no lie. Say, last season, that Tavares night cost me Arsenal no, no champions did because he said, when did they remember that uh, Crystal Palace match? We asked that play. So Tavares was out of position. Like after first half, the dog said, "Ah, if I did, I know what's in good for. I'm making come out Tavares because the guy was so immature. You know this thing. I'm waiting plenty of us not talk. Say it was because we had no squad depth. We say we get squad depth. All those guys, Tavares, Lukonga, Charlie Patino, who report for midfield. We wouldn't have done all that or carry Granny Shaka come up for defensive midfield, go to plan for left back, you know, all those kind of experimentation or carry Sedu Suarez go to plan for left back, go carry his round peg, go put up a square with things that you know it will not work but because you don't have the personnel or to me that's the way they seek will still bring them in complete. As part of the things we aggravate this guy injury, when in the seek we will still draft them in. No squad dead, so I don't blame the coach. We did what we could do with the little we had. So Baba come outside the complaints and Tavares cost everything, but thank God say this season. Everybody don't see him. That is why they sent him out to go and develop more because he never did ready for Arsenal. Arsenal did bigger than him. Men go develop more. Then when he has developed and become a better player, he can come and join us in the upcoming season. Well, it is what it is.
I'm not even Ben Jacobs, eh? Maybe one of our senior man transfer guru. Don't come and say, call the let us know. Say, Arsenal don't make formal inquiry to West Ham for Jared Bowen. See, they would like to sign the guy. No be rumor again. This one now for official. They don't ask West Ham. So, West Ham can let them know. Say, see, this nigga, we don't want to sell him. Our price assets. Imagine when person come down me to not say, I sell rounds there. I mean, I sell account, I will sell him. Now, so it just be for us here. You see this guy and declare rice. They are not for sale, and no reason now. So I don't know whether now nah, talk is cheap. I mean, they don't already sell them. I mean, the money they will find. I don't go raise the money up. I never really know. Time still day. Many, many deals go happen. I think I don't confirm and say they see the reason some people where they will sign. You get themselves, no say their squad depth never complete. They get some holes, so they need to plug the gap. So most of the watch are since they go. If things are the day more clearer. I'm gonna let you know. So if you don't know, watch yesterday's show, check the top left corner of your screen, you'll see the thumbnail. Click on so that you'll get all Arsenal updates as they drop all over the world. So start you signing out. Enjoy the rest of this new week and get mouse.